I think I found something. Washed up crab. <laughs> You will see die. The Equinox rain poncho set up in just a, a simple pitched mode. You're looking at Hood Canal. We are on the Olympic Peninsula. And here's a clue as to what we plan to do next. So what we're planning to do is to grab a few of these and we're going to have grilled oysters up under the lean-to. And I see a few right here. And three of these size is plenty. We're going to make it back up to the lean-to. Where's Cooper? And here are the oysters we plan to have. Three of them right there. Cooper's already interested too, he knows. Getting a little misty, getting a little foggy in here, but just like with every other hike, I'm gonna make myself a cup of coffee. We're just going to have the instant. Show you around a little bit while we're waiting for the boiling water. Photos today are going to be provided by my Sony Nex 5T. If you're interested in these uh, Mi Photo camera tripods, Wandering Beast has a review on uh, several sizes of these. This is the smallest me photo. But uh, Beast takes these out on all his adventures and he does a very good review on uh, two sizes of these. So if you're interested, check out Wandering Beast's channel. He turned me on to these. So I thought I'd uh, mention. You can check out his channel for me photo camera tripods. Coffee's done. What we're gonna do next is prep the Trangia. And I just happened to uh, acquire this grill. And Mrs. Wah Hiker is always so helpful. She had this and she said, go ahead. And it's unbelievable because this fits perfectly inside this Four Dogs titanium stove stand. See how that sits? So the Trangia is putting out the heat. We'll prep the oysters next. So here are the three Pacific oysters we've selected. <laughs> you, you see that? He's trying to help me open it. He knows. He knows what's in there. We'll just let you open this one. How's that? <laughs> oh, are you going to try it that way? Let me try the shucking tool grouper. Hold on. And while we're doing these on the beach, we need to return these shells back to the oyster bed, so there we go. For the next generation that is actually on the shell. Cooper. 
There we go. Look at that. There it is. Oyster number two. That's a pretty good size. See that? And again, we're returning these shelves back to the bed because on these shelves are the next generation. This one not so much, but uh, a lot of them. Let's scrape that off. The Trangi is all set up. And here are those oysters. these a little bit here. We'll spin these around. Oysters on the half shell. We'll spice these up a bit. I'm just using what I carry in my backpack. A little bit of olive oil. Have some garlic, an onion, and we'll move those around just to get them all nice and uh, cooked up properly. You can start to see that they are starting to uh, grill up nicely. Just to finish these off, I've uh, removed the simmer ring from the Trangia. I've moved the cooked ones out towards the outside. We're just waiting for the one that you can see boiling there. Just about done. Put the flame out on this uh, Trangia. Perfect! I'm thinking we're ready for a taste test. Here we go. Wait for it. Mmm. Excellent. Cooper want just a taste. Mm. Just a taste. Good boy. What do you think, huh? <laughs> Last one. Mm. 